Okay. As I promised, I'm doing a tutorial video now. So, this one is just what a lot of these features do. So, emails accounts is the first thing I'm going to teach how to use. First, you sign up. You just type in whatever email you want. So, whatever. I'll type in. Whatever. Out of emergency. What do dot x10 dot mx. And the password is what password you want. Sorry, I don't think this is gonna be very. <laughs> That'd be cool if it was just him. I'm not gonna make another one. Um. Sorry about the mic making an irritating noise. Um. It's just a crappy mic. Um. <coughs> you can check your webmail. Um, which I don't have anything in it. I'll do round cube. I always do that one. And you can see nothing. Oh, um, show you how it works. Watch. You do my name. You type in whatever the way name you want. Dot net. Here's <coughs> that. Then it loads. I think this is under the free version. If you want to check, let's see. <coughs> to do it. See, I don't think I can do it. Okay, go back to the home subdomain names. Which you can have people sign up for if they want to. Um, so people can come to your hosting account and sign up and host their website on it. Add on domains. Parts domains. <laughs> so that just points another one to your this domain. Redirects, which is something you enter in your see? I type my URL in that URL in and go to my URL my emergency alert webs com oh, one databases I don't really know where this was from. Um, but if you want to you can get software services <coughs> those are just code something I can't remember let's see you oh, know screw it front page extensions cron jobs error pages Index Manager and Image Manager. 
Now I'm going to start the teaching part of it. I only have five minutes left. Oh no. But, yeah, so the first tutorial will be on, let me see here, how to make a domain that redirects. If you type in this domain, redirects to a, to a different domain. So, so, it'll go to redirect to your other website. Let's say you... Ooh, let's do my... Uh... Okay, I'll do free weather alerts <coughs> and hit add. So I don't want that to stay like that because that one. So then there's just emergency alert group. So at home. And now the second tutorial will be on the DNS zone editor. So bring this up. Now on record and I have no idea what that does. So I'm not gonna mess with it. Let's see what the advanced one does. Well, it's kinda hard looking, so I'm not gonna do anything with it. So, my graphics is it different. Full graphics and it's ordered. So, we enjoy this little quick tutorial video, which wasn't much of a tutorial, I don't think. So. I will make a second part later sometime, so thank you for watching, comment, rate, and subscribe.